Hello, I'm Jason Stanley with Air Power Incorporated. Uh, one of the technical support specialists here. Today I'm going to talk to you about communicating with your QX tool with an Android device or with an Apple device. So we're going to start with the Apple iOS device. Uh, the first thing you have to do is download the Insight Connect app from Ingersoll Rand in the, uh, in the Apple App Store. Or once we get the Android, you download that in the Google Play Store. So on the back of the tool, we actually go in and select the icon that looks like a smartphone. And then on the app, there's a, there's a link icon up at the top. So once we go into pairing mode, that tool shows up there. We tap on it, we click OK. We get a pairing code and it tells us on the tool. So we go pair mode on the app, hit the check mark on the, on the tool, and boom, we're paired, ready to communicate. So now we're gonna look at the, the Android device. Uh, again, have to download the app from the Play Store. Um, what we're gonna do on the back of the tool is similar uh, we're going to select the smartphone app or smartphone icon, and then we'll select the uh, pair button in the uh, in the app. So it'll cycle through. We find our tool and available to tools. We hit the OK button. We get a six six digit code. We say pair. Hit the check mark on the tool. We're linked up and talking. So we're going to look at another way to communicate with a QX tool with an Android device. Uh, it could be a phone or a tablet. So we are looking at a hardwired connection now. Oh, there we go. So I've got a simple uh, cable that has a USB-C connection and the uh, Mini B. And what we're actually looking at is there's the model number of the tool. There's the current torque setting. So there's three ways that you can communicate with your QX tool with your mobile device.